Hello everyone. Hello. And welcome back to our channel. It's me Veronica. And me Mason Josh. And today we are in sunny London. Yay. Yay. Woo. Yay. Woo. And we're just driving down to Westfield. Yeah, lovely. Um, and what are we gonna do next? Okay, so we are gonna go to Westfield and we're gonna go find Lush. And Lush have a zero packaging shampoos. So they come as bars, like bars of soap. And I'm just so curious, I'm like, how the hell is that gonna work? So. How the hell is that gonna work? Yeah. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm really looking forward to Lush Cosmetics hair products. And uh, let's see what they've got to offer. Um, and before we continue, do not forget. Yes, like, subscribe. And Follow our Instagrams and, and actually follow <laughs> our actual hair people HQ Instagram HQ, yeah. where you will find out all the stuff first. There. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay, and let's do this. Yes. Oh, you will certainly detect difference to your shine. So this should make your hair shiny. Alright. And then you get this like what is it? Is Cork it? pot to put your Oh, that's a good idea. Awesome. Oh, so this, they can actually cut for you to what size you want. All right. That's nice. Avocado wash. So I'm guessing that would be quite moisturizing. Yeah, with this conditioning, blend, and softening. Yeah, so this is, this is supposed to be moisturizing, so I will take this. Really? Okay. So we've just done our last shopping. Yep, 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 yep. And we've we got so much stuff today. We've got so much stuff. Oh, okay, we're gonna test it in a minute. Yes, we're gonna see. We're gonna put all the shampoos in our hair. We're gonna test the conditioners. I also got some treatments as well, so we'll test those. And we will get back to you. Exciting. For our reviews, yes. we're gonna be doing a um, new thing now because we just think we need to put a structure to what we think about products. Yes. So we're gonna divide our reviews of each product, any product, today or yeah. in the future, for three. Yes, so we're gonna be right? we're gonna be grading these products out of three different things. First, appearance, second, smell, because that is important. Yeah. And third, um, and the most important is the usage. So yeah. it, whether or not it does what it says it's supposed to do. Yeah, exactly. So let's see if these are how people approved, you guys. You guys. <laughs> so I want to start off by first saying I've got avocado, which is a shampoo and it's supposed to be for moisturizing. And obviously, as I always say, I need moisture in my hair. Mm. Don't I, Veronica? Yes, we know that. We, we know need that. moisture on this baby. Yeah. And this, let me say something. It was unreal. Like, for one, the smell was unbelievable. Mm. I can't stop smelling it. <laughs> yeah, it's like... It's like sweets. Yeah. But I can't pinpoint what bloody hell the sweet is. But it's literally like, this is like a sweet. Mm. Um, and I just thought the fact that it actually lathered so well on my, on my hand and then transferring that onto my hair, it literally felt like I was using a really expensive, amazing shampoo. Yes. It, it was actually so luxurious. Like out of five for appearance, I would have to say, because it's so unconventional and I do like a beautiful packaging, and obviously this is package free, I would say I'd rate this out two out of five mm. because it's just weird. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, but out of smell, I would definitely have to rate this five out of five. Like, wow. you have banged on this. This is yeah. freaking amazing. Um, in terms of usage, taking into account everything, it's not a liquid. Um, I don't know how long this lasts for. I've used this once and it hasn't really gone that smaller. Mm. Um, but I would say, for the fun of it, four out of five because it actually was quite pleasing to use. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay. Yeah. Lovely. Oh, avocado, well done. Avocado. avocado, well done. Okay, I've picked a shampoo. It's called Coconut Rice. It was meant to be for volume, but I think the person who recommended this to me didn't really know the product that well because really? it's actually, according to the website, it's actually for damaged, almost bleached hair. Which, oh, that's wrong. Yeah, I mean, yeah, that will do. 
And I mean, it looks beautiful. Yeah. It's got some kind of flower on top. Okay, Lush. <laughs> okay, Lush. I've got one problem with those products. They are they just sticky and it, it is kind of gross. Yeah, it is. It's, it's weird. It's not conventional. I understand if you're package free, then obviously... If you're package free and you, you're definitely like aiming to reduce the packaging out of your life completely, then fantastic, then great. <laughs> and if you're not... If you're not, then probably there are other ways of eco washing your hair. Yeah, like maybe even like refillable shampoo. Yeah, this is beautiful and it definitely does the job. It foams fantastically. Uh, it smells. I mean, it's a bit more delicate than other. Pretty, <laughs> really, pretty, pretty delicate. Yeah. No, I mean, look. Is I want to eat it! It looks, it looks like, it looks like cake! It looks like, uh, what's it called? Um, those little French things. Macaroni! Yeah, macaroon! 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 <laughs> macaroon! Yeah. So, so, so what would you rate this out of five? Really? So, okay, so for my cupcake, <laughs> for my little cupcake, I think for appearance, I mean strong four out of five. Okay, It okay. looks delicious. Yeah. And I want to eat it. When it comes to smell, I actually do like stuff that doesn't smell like that crazy. So, um, so for, for the smell, let's do four out of five. So when it comes to usage, I'm going to say three out of five because it does get messy. But actually they do sell, so Lash sell oh, yeah. those corks uh, for seven pounds. Yeah. I mean, yeah. obviously, you're not gonna like it will be there forever, but these little tray things that you can put your shampoo on, so it, like you won't have it all over your shower or all over your bath. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Good shout. I didn't do that. My bad. But that's why I'm giving you three out of five. Lovely. This is called Big, and it's a conditioner. Again, it's supposed to be for quite moisturising. And honestly, I used it, and I didn't really feel feel it that much. Like, I think maybe I was overwhelmed by the avocado shampoo, which is really moisturising as well, mm. and actually does the job. This, I found it a little bit awkward to get on my hair. Really? In what way? I mean, okay, I, I'm, I'm talking about my ass a little bit, because it did work, and like, it, it, it was large enough my hands that you could transfer it onto your hair, but in the end I kind of had to just sort of rub it into my head. Oh, really? And it did do it, but for me, it wasn't moisturising enough. Yeah. But it wasn't horrible. I'm just talking about for me. Mm. I mean... But then you know, like, you could obviously rub it like into your hair because you've got short hair, but what about people who don't have I mean, I long hair? Like, who, like who what do you rub? Like, like this. Do you know what I mean? They're going like, like that. But I don't know. For me, this kind of missed the mark a bit. Mm. I would say out of five for appearance, I would say that's nothing special to me. No. Um, so I would say two out of five. For smell, it smells, it just smells really fresh, it doesn't really smell. Does it, it smells like a toilet uh, thing, to be honest. <laughs> oh my god, it does! It does, right? Yeah, so for smell, I'm not gonna lie, yeah, I would say two out of five. And then for actual usage, again, I'd probably say two out of five. I might not have been using it properly, but this is, this is my verdict, yeah. really. But at the same time, you know, I just feel like, like with hair products, it should be a bit more straightforward. Like you can't say, oh, oh, I can't use it properly because then what, do you need the training before yeah. using this you stuff? Know, I mean, the thing is what I will say about conditioners, they want you to wet these and put it in your hands and put it in your hair. When I use conditioner, I, don't, I really towel dry my hair. So oh, it kind of goes right. beyond the point. It's just oh, too wet. Right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. Um, yeah, yeah. Maybe it's bigger for you because obviously you like less in your hair. Well, so I did get myself a um, conditioner. Again, it looks kind of the same, but it's golden. What? Yeah. What do you feel of it? I mean, it stinks. Let me smell. Oh my. Oh my God. Is it like? What is it? <laughs> so it's it's called Gold Bar. The golden. Golden cap. The golden cap press conditioner. Lemon balm. Chocolate perfume, but I don't know. There is this really annoying smell in it, 
and it makes me gag. <laughs> Do you know what? It smells like really natural. Maybe yeah, too natural. Yeah, like too natural for me, I think. We love a really artificial perfume. Yeah, I mean, it's, look, it, it still says that it's got perfume in it. Yeah. And I'm just like, where is this perfume? <laughs> yeah, put the perfume in it. Put the perfume in it. Yeah. Um, it didn't do the job for the conditioning side for me. What do you rate it? For usage, I'll probably say one out of five for the usage. I, I feel like it's a bit more hype than like good quality of hair care. Yeah. When it comes to appearance, two out of five, nothing special. Uh, and when it comes to smell, one out of five. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> bye bye. No, I just no. Honestly, I I I feel the vibe with less packaging and taking care of our planet. But let's find something else. So yeah, I think it is a bit hit and miss. Go and try some stuff, and like, if you are package free, I'm sure this is what yeah. amongst the best of products rather yeah. than other products to use. Yeah, but I definitely will try to find some other package free stuff. Yeah, that Ronald um, actually likes. That this I is the, this will is like. the test. Yeah. And let's let's see, you know, because I feel like it's just such a big market at the moment of package free stuff. So I think it's just the beginning for all the beauty brands to kind of explore yeah. that um, vibe. H how about out of five would you give Lush as a whole for shampoo and conditioner? For this idea, for, the, for this idea, have, for the pack, for the, the package free stuff, for the package free stuff. I mean, smell four out of five. Probably they do have a miss like gold bar. Yeah. Conditioner. Mm -hmm. But maybe it's just my own. You know, I just don't like the smell. Yeah. Uh, but the smells are cute. Yeah. Uh, appearance. Three out of five. I mean, they they do have better stuff like this. That is cute, but to be honest, I, I I'm 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 a sucker for package packaging. I don't know. I, for me, I would say more like two out of five. Yeah. For pack, for, for for how it looks. Yeah. Function, on the other hand, shampoos work. I would honestly say five out of five for me. Um, but yeah. Yeah, four out of five. They do work. They yeah. do work. Uh, the question is how much of a hair care they are. Yeah. I feel like it's the purpose of this stuff is just literally to get rid of the grease from your hair. Yeah. Not like look after your hair. And it's not all sulfate free, which is yeah. what we are always banging on about and always looking yeah. for. They did replace um, SLS with SCS, which is a coconut sulfate. Yeah. Uh, it's still a sulfate because you know the, still foams. Yeah, it's still foams, and I feel like if they would, they would decide, okay, let's do stuff like this without foaming, then no one will get it, no one will buy it. Yeah. Because that would be like, well, oh I'm great, so my hair is still greasy. Thanks. Yeah, literally. I feel like the foam is the aspect, especially yeah these days. Which they've got right. Yeah, they've got it right. They actually have it. I would actually, I'm not gonna lie, I would, I'm gonna carry on using the avocado shampoo until it's finished. Like, it is actually. Really? Yeah, it's lovely and it smells amazing. That smells incredible. Um, so, that's my favourite of the day. If you got a favourite? I am my favourite of the day. <laughs> <laughs> of course! Of course! If I have to choose something that will be this. Um, <laughs> if you have to. <laughs> <laughs> macaron looking shampoo. Yeah. But you know, I feel like with this stuff, I would, I could get confused and like, you know, got hungry having a bath and like try. To <laughs> Are you always hungry in the bath? Well, you never know. You know sometimes you might be like, oh, I'm hungry. Oh, this looks like food. Yum. <laughs> Yum. This is our opinion. Our opinion is our own. And thank you so much for watching today. Do not forget to subscribe. Yes, do not forget to subscribe, hit the bell not to miss any other videos. Definitely, and give us a thumbs up. Yes, and to all the people who might want our opinion about other stuff, we yeah. did a video on um, hair treatments that you can get from Boots. Yes. And they are not package free, boohoo, but they are, some of them are quite good. So go yeah. and have a look. Yeah, and do not forget to follow the Instagram and do not forget to follow our new Instagram called The Hair People HQ. HQ, and see you there. See you there.